Shalom. All praises, glory, and honors to Yahweh, Bahasham Yahweh Shai, Bahasham Racha HaKadosh, and double honors to the apostles, and to the elders of Great Millstone, peace and salutations to the elect. I am your brother, Mark from the Great Millstone, Jamaica camp, here with another lesson, hoping to feed the potential elect, you know, through the spirit and power of Yahweh, Bahasham Yahweh Shai. As we are facing some serious times, you know, in prophecies, man, you know, we would think that all these things that, that, that are happening throughout the world, Jake would want to repent. And when I say Jake, I'm making reference to the Israelites, which are the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. And we, yes, we are scattered among all nations. We are, we are throughout the four corners of the earth. And you would think our people would want to repent from our wicked ways, you know, which, you know, there's going to be times when certain loss come upon our people. And even us being in the truth, sometimes we might fall short to some certain things, but yet, you know, um, <clears throat> not willingly, you know, that's the reason why we have Yahweh Shai, you know, as a mediator to, you know, to pacify the Lord, Yahweh, our father of his wrath that he's about to bring upon his bitch. You know, and, um, you know, sometimes you want to beat yourself, but there are certain, there are certain transgressions just, it isn't toler tolerable, man. Like this one that I'm about to play here on the screen. Man, this is, this is cruel. This is just pure cruelty, man. Look at this, yeah? <laughs> And I'm gonna. I'm, I think. I think I'm. I should stop it right there. You know, for YouTube guidelines and shit. No, what's happening in this video? I'm tempted to play, but what's happening in this video is this woman. She's pregnant, and she have that hammer. Using that hammer, and hitting her stomach so hard to abort that baby. That's in her stomach. No. Alright, let me not say stomach, her womb, my bad. No. No, you would think, what, what's the cause and, you know, why is this thing happening? What is, is, is the guy that she got pregnant for say it's not her child, you know? What's the reason? Regardless, man, nevertheless, it's just pure wickedness man to be using a hammer see and, and a part of the problem is that the condition you have people go about and do these things because of the conditions condition of the time cost of living is so high you see these 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 are the reasons why we need yahweh basham yahweh shai man we need yahweh shai to come back and burn this bitch because without the lord this these things would never ever stop man it will never ever stop. And as and as my 30 years up on this planet, going 31 years now, being on this planet, man. This thing is only getting worse and worse and worse. I don't want to live another 30 years here witnessing. I, I can't I, I can only imagine. What the, the, the generation 10, 15 years from now is going to look like, man. And what they're going to be like. Yeah? So, let me get some scriptures, man. Because you know we flow um, <clears throat> based off of the scriptures, man. So this, this is Job 39, verses 13. It says, Gave as though the goodly wings unto the peacocks are wings and feathers unto the ostrich. Alright? It says, which... Leave her eggs in the earth and warm them in the dust. Now, the ostrich area is speaking of a literal ostrich. It's speaking of the nation of Israel. And it's also speaking about the women, you know, among the nation of Israel. Right? Verse 15, it says, And forget it that the foot may crush them, or that the wild beast may break them, because they themselves... Trample the eggs a lot of the times, man, which shows that they are 
deprived of understanding. Well, it's the same thing with this woman on the video, man, using the hammer, bang, bang, in her, in, 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 in her stomach to, 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 to basically kill the child. He says, and forget it that the foot may crush them or that the wild beast may break them. She is hardened against her young ones as though they were not hers. Her labor is in vain without fear. These women, majority of these women, hardened against their young ones, man. Growing up, my mother used to call me. Every, 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 every um, time my mother get to, to curse my ass out, she always say, oh, you dirty father, you dirty father. She had problems with my dad. And, and and she basically used to, you know, tell me that she hate me because, you know, like my dirty papa. She, in Jamaica, we say dirty papa. You know, she been saying, my dirty father, this, my dirty father, that. You know, she, she would want to basically take out um, that stress against me. Man, it's, it's terrible growing up. It's terrible growing up here, you know, in, um... In, in Babylon, man, in the valley of the shadow of death, being a young male child, I'm telling you, especially when your father, you know, is a deadbeat dad or he's not in the old soul, man. Crazy shit like this will happen. It says, so, verse 16, Job 39, verse 16, she is hardened against her young ones as though they were not hers. Her labor is in vain without fear because the most had deprived her of wisdom. Neither had he imparted to her understanding, man. How the hell would you want to be hitting your stomach with a goddamn hammer? Mm. I just, I just had, I had to peek that one in, man. She been eating her stomach with that hammer, poop. And and she basically she get worse doing it, man. As in, she started to hit it harder, man. Some some gruesome hit, poop. Like she just make up her mind that look, I'm killing this child. And as I said, you know, growing up as a male child, man. It, <laughs> Oh wow man. That what they about show me how shy man. For this truth. Job 14 verse 1. Man that is born of a woman is a few days and full of trouble. It's, it's just madness from every angle, man. And you would think, you would think that these women would would be all into their children. Because women, you know, that's 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 their love, man. Children should be, you know, the love. For women, but this is what the scripture says, man, you know. Uh, Deuteronomy 28 verse 56, it says, The tender and delicate woman among you, which would not adventure to set the sole of her foot upon the ground, for her delicateness and tenderness, her eye shall be evil towards the husband of her bosom, and towards her son, and towards her daughter. And this, this, this is true, man. This, this, is not, this, is, this is not a lie. This is not no makeup story, man. And, 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 and a part of the reason for that is because you people lack faith. Because, uh, let's, let's just say the, 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 the guy that got, got her pregnant. Yeah? I'm not saying this is the case, but just, let's just say the guy that got her pregnant decided that he didn't want to do anything with the child. You know, he didn't want to do anything with her. What about the Heavenly Father, man? What about the Lord, man? You know, you don't know if that child... Was supposed to be born to win the goddamn ladder to take your ass out of, 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 of bondage, man. Just word speaking. Jet, you're a faithless people. And that's the reason why Yahawashai keep on stress faith um, throughout the Gospels, man. And he always said, when he returns, shall I find faith? You can see that you people are faithless. That's the reason why there is no, there is no real pressure as yet. And a lot of you lining up, running, going to take your, 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 your juice, man. And all of you that took the Johnson and Johnson think that, yo, yes, it's, it's, yo, I don't have to take anymore. Well, your government 
telling you about them boosters, man. You, in, you people are in trouble, man. The Lord set your asses up. See if, if you repent. Repentance is key, man. It's, it's the gateway to, 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 to live in the good life in the kingdom of heaven. Man. See? Ah, man. Telling you, Jake, man. Jake, Jake, Jake. Isaiah chapter 49 verse 15 says, Can a woman forget her sucking child? That she should not have compassion on the womb, on, so like, on the son of her womb. Yea, they may forget. I will not forget thee. And this is the Lord Yahweh Shai, man. Yahweh Bashami Shai. The Lord said, They might forget, but he will not forget us, man. And we are fearing that. Because, see, the woman, boom, being hit in her stomach, boom. Which is against the law, man. You're not, you're not supposed to do that shit, man. You know? Exodus chapter 23, verse 26. There shall, not, there shall nothing cast their young, nor be barren in thy land. The number of thy days I will fulfill. Basically, this is if we, if, if we kept the law. But in the kingdom, it will be so. We're not supposed to do that, man. See... We're not supposed to encourage shit like this to happen. Have faith, man. Faith. For, for, for our spirit to be entered into the, into the earth, it is of Yahweh Basham Yahushai. And for our spirit to be taken out of the earth, it is of Yahweh Basham Yahushai. You control nothing, man. See, and I, even with me and my kids, I always, I always tell my kids that, look, I am just here to guide you to live um, the right life. Because we all have individual spirits, man. And I have to live my life. And you guys have to live your lives, man. So I'm just here to, 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 to nurture you, you know, and comfort you while you can't until you have to walk that path. Being a grown-up. And all you have to do, man, is just have faith in your heart, Basha, man. You know? All we have to do is just have faith. Man, I hope, that, I hope, that's it. I hope that this lesson has been an edifying one. Shalom.